Welcome back to YouTube. I have Ahmed again from In-Depth Tech Reviews. And in today's video, I'm going to share with you my Google Assistant top list of commands and features that will make your life easier. After creating 31 episodes about Google Apps updates and 11 other Google Assistant dedicated videos, here are my top picks. So without further ado, let's jump in. Let's start with the things you can do on your phone. And the first one in the list is the read aloud feature. If you read articles about your favorite topics like I do, you must give the read aloud feature of Google Assistant a try. It can read articles without the need to look at your phone. Not only this, but it can read the same article in 52 different languages. So if you are facing a hard time understanding the article you are interested in, let Google Assistant translate it and read it in your favorite language. The read aloud feature is a huge time saver for me. Imagine if you can listen to your favorite articles while working out, going to work, laying on the couch, and more. The scenarios are endless, but no matter which one you are in, this feature is very useful. You can use it on iOS devices too via the Google app. Just to open or search for the article you want and tap the read aloud button at the top right corner. Number two, never forget about your stuff. We usually lend stuff to family or friends and forget about them over time. So let your Google assistant remember this for you. Remember that my wife borrowed my headphones. Okay, I'll remember that. Who borrowed my headphones? I remember you told me. Or you can use it to remember where you placed things. Remember that my laptop charger is in the nightstand drawer. Okay, I'll remember that. Where is my laptop charger? I remember you told me. Number three is hum to search. This is the most popular Google Assistant feature I have ever seen to date, where you can identify songs by humming, whistling, or singing, which is useful when all you know about the song is the rhythm. What's the name of this song? Sounds like one of these. I had a couple of videos back in October 2020 and January 2021 covering the feature on Android and iOS, so if you didn't know about them, they are worth checking, and I will drop the links in the description below. Even James Corden featured the hum to search in the Late Late Show, which made it even more popular, and from my experience, it helped me identify songs that I've been looking for for a very long time. Number four, let Google Assistant help you shopping. There are two different ways. First, you can start by adding stuff to your shopping list over time and ask Google Assistant to show you the list when it's the right time. The second way is even more useful. You can ask Google Assistant to remind you to buy stuff at a certain location like this. Remind me to buy milk when I'm at the supermarket. You've got a few choices. The first is Gen Express Remram at Unnamed Road. Do you mean this place? Yes. Okay, I'll remind you when you get to Gen Express Remram at Unnamed Road. Buy this when you reach the supermarket, you will immediately get a reminder, which is very useful. Number five, never forget a date. We all have important dates in life that we shouldn't forget about, but unfortunately we do, like anniversaries, birth dates, and more. So let Google Assistant do the work for you. Remind me to buy a gift one day before my wife's birthday. Got it, buy a gift too. This will be for October 1st. At what time? 12 p.m. Sure, I'll remind you on October 1st at noon. Trust me, this feature will save you the embarrassment. And now it's time for today's sponsor. This video is sponsored by Aura. They make a comprehensive digital security platform that's simple to understand and easy to use. Think about all of your online accounts, finances, and devices. What are you doing to protect them? Because if you are like most people, you are probably reusing your passwords all over the place and a data breach to any one of those services could spell a lot of trouble. Every seven seconds, someone becomes a victim of fraud or identity theft and a lot of these people never recover their stolen money. Let's talk about how Aura can protect you. Aura is a new type of service that protects your online data, connection, and devices with one simple subscription. You will get alerted to fraud and the threats really fast, like if your online accounts or passwords were leaked online, or if someone tries to open a bank account in your name. Aura's apps will also protect your devices from malware and encrypt your Wi-Fi connection, so you can shop, bank, and stream online privately. With an easy online dashboard and alerts sent straight to your phone, Aura keeps you in control and guides you through solving any issues. And the best part is, all plans come with $1 million in identity theft insurance to help recover your stolen funds. With experienced US-based customer support that's got your back. So, if you want a secure presence from hackers, scammers, and noisy advertising companies, go to aura.com tech 
And when you use my link below, you will get 40% discount on all plans. And now let's get back to the review. Now let's talk about the features that can help you manage your day and smart devices. Any virtual assistant can create automations or routines to control your smart home devices in a way or another, but there are a couple of new additions to Google Assistant that I didn't see in other assistants like Siri or Alexa. The first one is the day-long routines. Now with Google Assistant, you can create one routine that includes multiple actions, and each action will have its own time throughout the day. For example, I have one routine that handles my lights all day, every day. I added three actions that will take place at different times. The first one will adjust the lights to 50% at 5.30 a.m. The second one will turn them off at 6 a.m. And finally, at 6.40 p.m., all the lights will be turned back on. This will save you from the hassle of creating a routine for each action, which is neat. There are a lot of other scenarios to get the most out of this feature. For example, you can use it to remind you to take a break or drink water every couple of hours, or maybe remind you to take your medicine. The second new feature is the delayed response. It's similar to the day-long routines, but instead of adding timings to your actions, you can let them start one after the other based on a certain time delay. In this example, I have a routine that I can trigger by saying help me leave on time. This routine is 30 minutes long. Once it triggered, the countdown will start for 10 minutes. And when the time's up, it will say you have 20 minutes left. After another 10 minutes, I will get another reminder saying that I only have 10 minutes left. Then after another 5 minutes, I will get my third reminder and so on until it's time for me to leave. You can use this feature in many other scenarios that include multiple actions and these actions depend on each other. Both features are explained in detail in my 31st episode about Google Apps updates. So if you want to know more, please check the video link in the description below. Next, get the most out of your Google Smart Speaker. I've been using the Google Home Mini for years now. It has a reasonable price, looks good, and has some useful features too. My favorite one is the family broadcast. You can use it to send voice messages directly to your family members from your phone wherever you are. And they can reply back okay. as well. Broadcasting to home devices and family phones. Family broadcast. Can you please answer your What's phone? I cannot reach you. You will also get a chat-like interface on your phone with all the voice messages sent back and forth between you with the ability to play the voice messages. The second feature is called Family Bill. It can allow you to schedule custom bills that announce upcoming activities to your family on your home devices, like setting a bill for bedtime, It's bedtime. a bill for breakfast, It's breakfast time. another one for cleaning, and more. So that was my top list of Google Assistant features and there are a lot more to come in the future. As usual, I will keep you posted with the latest and the greatest features from Google. So stay tuned and hit the subscribe button if you didn't already. Thank you for watching and see you the next video.